How's it going lads and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video I've got for you is 15 two player packs because the UCL uh, live items or wants to watch are still in packs. It's currently Thursday evening right now. Uh, well, it's actually Thursday night. It's 8 p.m. on Thursday night. But um, the UCL live items are still in packs. So I wanted to open these before they go out of packs tomorrow. But I wanted to upload this on Saturday now. On the Saturday morning you're actually watching this, it's my 20th birthday. So if you don't comment happy birthday, then you're banned from the channel for the rest of your life and you're never coming back. But surprisingly, yes, I'm going to be 20 or I'm 20 now. That's scary in itself. But I thought, why not celebrate with some gold upgrade packs and see if you can give me a little bit of luck now. Want to quickly throw this out there. I opened all the promo packs, which were 45k packs. I opened all five of them. Didn't get a single board. Opened the 50k pack from the icon, pri the prime icon set three that came out like two hours ago. That's actually been removed now. Uh, got I opened the 50k pack from that and got like Malcolm as my best player. It was awful. So my look does not seem in right now. We'll uh, we'll see we'll see how it is. We'll see if we can get a walkout from any of these gold upgrade packs. If we can get a UCL live item. That would be fantastic. In fact, I actually packed one from a gold upgrade, I want to say like a day ago, two days ago now. Um, and I quickly show you guys as well. Uh, where is he? By the way, I updated my team. This is what the team's looking like. So if I can pack any of these cards on tradable, that'd be fantastic. But I packed Lingard. Haven't used him yet. I'm going to have him as a super sub. 90 stamina is pretty dope. Um, and he's got some pretty nice stats. Uh, and in terms of untradables in this squad, the only untradable is actually Felipe Anderson and, of course, the red eye, the red player pick and uh, and Milinkovic Savage. Um, so if I pack legit any of those gold items, that would be fantastic because I could sell their uh, sell their uh, normal item for, for, you know, coin value and then upgrade the team with that coin value. So any of them would be fantastic. Let's see if we can pack any of them. Uh, hopefully, we can get at least one walkout from 15 gold upgrade packs because if not, I'm going to be a bit disappointed because I cleared out my club of non-rares that I've been stacking for ages. Um, I'll tell you what, it was it was quite the... Um, Quite the 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 time-consuming effort to just clear it out because I've got so many untradables now that either I have to go through like 50 pages of rares or go through like 15 pages of, of untradables just to get to the non-rares. It was stressful, but we managed to do it. It took like an hour, but um, we get a walkout. Here we go. Come on, excitement time. It's going to be an inform walkout. Come on, someone big. Uh, party, Thomas Party. That's actually fantastic. That is a great super sub. Let's go. I'm actually really happy about that. That's a fu dude. That is such a good super sub. He's gonna probably replace Allen. I'm not entirely sure. Um, that's a great card though. How much is he going for right now? How much is he going for right now? Thomas Party, where are you, lad? He's about thirty thousand coins, so he's actually not that much. But that's still pretty sick. That is that is great. Now I was hoping for a Royce, but that's still pretty dope. That's still pretty fantastic. We'll take it. And he's actually got really nice stats. So he might replace Alan as a super sub. Not entirely sure. The only difference is Alan has actually got four star skills, which is fantastic when you bring him on. So we might have to think about it. But uh, but no, we'll take it. We've had a walkout out of three so far. If we got another walkout throughout this video, that would be very successful. Let's just say that. It'd be a very successful video. So uh, we're, of course, not going to get a walkout in the next pack. But I'm happy about that. We get Dennis Suarez. If you give me the real Suarez, I'd be pretty excited about that too. Um, no, I'm, 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 I'm really happy about that. That's a, that's a great pull. Uh, and I will have to do some serious thinking about whether he is better than Alan, uh, his, Alan's UCL card, of course, or, um, or not. So, uh, that will be some serious comparing to do as well. Because, uh, I've got to think, Party's six foot one. So, he's tall, he's got really great stamina, he's quite pacey, and he's got great, great defending stats as well, and great physical stats. So, Alan's like 5'8 or 5'9, but Alan's just a little bulldog. He's so good. So, uh, yeah, I'll have to think about that one. But uh, but any coins I get from these players is nice as well. I do have a, literally a club full, and I mean full, stacked to the brim with players because I've been opening packs and just storing absolutely everything. So, um, all of these players that I, I'm discarding now, it's nice because I, I do want to go through and discard all my players at some point, but I just can't be bothered. I just don't have the time or the energy to, to go through my club of all of the players and uh, and get all the coins back from them. The, but I might have to do it at some point. I might have to give it a go at some point. You know what? In looking at them, actually, Alan's got better defending and dribbling. Party's got better at literally everything else. Um, and the shooting's better on Party as well. Uh, but Alan's got a four-star skill move. He's a medium-high work rate, whereas Party's got a high-high. Uh, and I think... Uh, his long shots are 80. It's, that's going to be a tough one. That's a tough one. Let me know in the comments down below 
whether you would go with Party or whether you would go with Alan. I'd love to hear your opinions because I can't decide, to be honest. I don't know which one I should go with. But um, we'll open the rest of these packs. We've got nine remaining. So if we get a walkout from any of these, I'll be very happy. EA, be kind, please. Give me give me a nice little birthday present of, a, of an untradeable Cristiano Ronaldo, why don't you? Treat me, eh? <laughs> yeah, no, never going to happen. But, uh, but we'll still open these regardless as we get Ruben something or other. I didn't even see that guy's name. Uh, Ruben Sabrino and uh, Kver Kjella. Nice. Nice one, EA. Thank you very much. All right. Eight packs left. We're just about the halfway mark. Uh, so we've got a walkout to show for it, actually. Um, so we've not done too bad. We've not had, actually, we've not had a single normal board drop yet. So that's interesting. We've had one walkout with no boards. So... Pretty interesting. We'll see uh, We'll see how the rest of these packs go. And if we can get ourselves a board drop or not, that would be nice. We get Lecomte there, an 81 rated. We'll go ahead. Actually, is he selling for anything? I'm trying to think of the uh, of the marquee matchups. And I can't think of the, any players that go for a whole lot this week. Because rewards are just awful in marquee matchups. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but they just seem to be nerfed. It's always like silver premium players packs. And it's like, we don't want silver packs. But that's that's ea for you i guess that's ea at the end of the day regardless let's uh let's open the rest of these packs who's this gonna be forsberg i think again i think i packed him in the first pack not great not great yeah i, I think that's actually two untradeable duplicates we'll just discard both of them there uh but we have six packs remaining we're about to get to the two-third mark actually uh this is the uh this this gets us to two-thirds of the way through the video we got a normal board drop here who's this gonna be someone decent it's gonna be a spanish center mid Gerard Moreno, Manu Trigueros, yeah, same sort of thing actually. Gerard Moreno is a striker actually, I think, but uh, same nation and, and, and team. It's a bit meh, really. 83 rated. I'm really looking for those 84s, 85s. But we get Jean Shakiri as well. He might sell for a little bit. Does he? I don't know. Maybe. No, no, not at all actually. It's crazy how easy it is to get coins in this game. It just makes players that are OP but not high rated so cheap. It's just ridiculous. But we've got five packs left. Hopefully, we can get a walkout in one of these five. It's not going to be from this one, though, sadly. It's not going to be from this one. But, if, hey, EA, if you want to drop me, like, I don't know, like a Diego Costa or just, like, an 85, like a company or something, I would happily, happily take it because that would be very nice. But we have a duplicate Dennis Suarez there. We'll go ahead and discard him. We've got four packs remaining. If we get a walkout, I'll be very excited. I keep saying it. I hope we're going to get a walkout, but we just don't get a walkout. EA, come on, mate. Who's this going to be? He's going to be Vardy. Hey, Jamie Vardy. Not bad. Actually, the first time I've packed Jamie Vardy in an untradeable pack this year. I was really hoping I'd pack him earlier on in the year when he was OP. Now everyone's got like... Oh, well, even I've got Ronaldo. So, you know, <laughs> Vardy's not going to... Um, Vardy's not going to really make it into my team, is he? But third to last pack is not going to be a board drop at all. You know what? These packs haven't been fantastic. But, uh, party's decent, but... He's just no, like, solid. There's not been a single solid player in any of these packs. So, 15 of them kind of wasted. I might have to go ahead and do a couple more after this just to see if we can get anything decent as we don't get a walkout in the second to last pack, the penultimate pack. Is it going to be... It's going to be literally nothing. It's going to be Bravo. Like, it, the pack look on my account recently has just been not very good. All right, last of the 15. Let's see if we can get anything good from this one. It's going to be a non-walkout, a non-board drop. I mean, nothing. A non-caring, me, non-caring non, no from me as we get some crappy 78s. All right, I'm going to go ahead and do a couple more and then we'll see what we can get from those. Okay, so I've gone ahead and done another five so that we round it off at 22 player packs. It's just quite a nice number to round it off on. Round it off on. By the way, I'm super tired, so if I've been slurring words or just like mispronouncing stuff i do apologize i'm just absolutely shattered the last few days have been busy as anything so uh you know that's why i'm pre-recording a video for saturday as well because just got busy day after busy day after busy day but you know what videos come before sleep so we're always gonna get these videos out right so we've got four more of these left i would ideally like another at least board drop uh or a walkout or something because the amount of packs I've opened as of recently, I feel like I haven't been rewarded at all. And it's just putting me off opening more packs. So, you know, if I don't get like a board drop or a walkout or something from these last couple, then I'm probably not going to do packs for a little while. So, uh, so yeah, I feel like I just duplicated packs, but maybe I didn't. Maybe, maybe there was, I feel like there's three there and I just opened one and still got three left. I don't even know. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and open the last three. So surely we should get something decent, I feel like. Uh, I, I'll be very surprised if we don't. I will be very surprised if we don't. Not even a board drop. I'll be very surprised if we don't get at least a board drop. So, let's go ahead and open these last two. 
Come on, EA, show me that EA. Ah, oh, I really want that EA Sports logo. All right, we got a board drop. There we go. I was going to say, I'd be surprised if we didn't get at least a board drop. It's going to be Bastos. The prize in form this week, sadly. So it's going to be Bastos, but we'll take it. 83 rated. Pretty meh, but we'll take it regardless. Can we get something good in the last pack, though, EA? Please. Please, 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 please. Nope. No, we cannot, sadly. Is it going to be not even a board drop? So. We end it on a stinker. But if you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like down below. Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new around here. It's greatly appreciated. And ring that notification bell. Turn that on because that notifies you every time I upload. That's pretty important because YouTube doesn't like to push out notifications all the time. So it's greatly appreciated if you guys do turn that on. It just helps. Oh, sorry. It just helps. I don't know why I apologize to my mic arm then. It just helps like videos being pushed out. It really does. And, uh, uh, and sometimes people don't always get the notifications and I just I like the idea of everyone being able to get the notification to know when I've uploaded it if they want to. So if you want to, please ring that bell. Thank you for watching and I'll see you lads later.